What's up, everybody? Infected Mushroom in the studio. Video blog. Friends on Mushroom, Volume 3. Last in the episode. And as promised, a video blog every year. One. One a year. Maybe one a year, yeah. One a year, right? It's a, this is what we promise. We promise, we deliver. Yeah. So, uh, Friends on Mushroom, Volume 3, ready? Uh, four tracks. One collab with Savant, uh, which actually starts the EP. The name is Rise Up. Mr. Savant uh, is singing on this track and he actually doesn't like this version so uh, he's going to make another version uh, that is a little bit more psychedelic I think. Yeah, so this is, this is our version, uh, it's a shorter version and it's more how we say the, on the infected vibe and uh, you're listening to it in the background. Yeah. Very good song, we tested it, we like it and uh, you better rise up. Second song on this uh, EP Ares uh, is called Kipod. Now there was a lot of talk about if Kipod is a porcupine or a hedgehog, something yeah. like that. We don't really care. Yeah, it's uh, it's, like, it's who cares? Who cares? There, it's, uh, it's, it's yeah. Fine. Anyway, this song was written. Uh, uh, I was in baby mode, uh, and I wrote a song basically for a kid. No. It's like Kipodlo It's like a children. It's like a children's song, I think. And then Erez made an amazing whistle. First of all, it's the keypod. Oh, so a keypod is a porcupine that wants to dance. Basically, that's what the song means, no? Yeah, and why why shouldn't he dance? Why shouldn't he dance? Should he be boring and just walk? He wants to dance. And for him to dance, we did this track. Yeah, basically. So it's, it's basically a track for porcupines. Or hedgehogs. Or hedgehogs, yeah. Wh- Whatever you want to do. We're not racist, you know. We're, no, we're, so there's no racism here. Yeah. So anyway, this track is uh, Psytrance 145. Uh, old school kind of infected mushroom. Pretty psychedelic. Pretty psychedelic. And I think you're going to like it. It's an amazing porcupine song. One of my favorite parts here, by the way. And I like to do this on the last one. Ready? And it does the Yeah, great song, psychedelic, psy trance. Uh, and yeah, uh, we're already playing it. It works really well. It's amazing. It is amazing. Third song on the album uh, is called Bark. Uh, it's actually started as a weirdo magnet, which we're not going to talk about it this blog, but uh, I don't know. Started as weirdo magnet and became infected mushroom track. Kind of dubstep with heavy metal influences. Very strong track on the dance floor. Uh, we played this as well. And what I really like about this track, besides the groove that he has, is the rise in the end. The rise in the end reminds me of Vicious Delicious kind of times, uh, orchestra, tempo change, and not really a tempo change, but more chord change when the rise is going up, and it's really, really strong in the goes. Yeah, amazing. Bark, amazing track, and uh, well, I think you will enjoy it. Fourth track in this EP is called Who Is There. It's a 130 BPM kind of dance track, but more of a heavy sound into it. Uh, and also works really well on the dance floor. Again, a kick track. So you have like basically two dub electro tracks and two kick kind of side trance and so kind of side trance, electro trance. Electro. It's like slow side trance, okay. Electro slow trance. Whatever, okay. whatever trance. It's called whatever trance. trance. Whatever trance. It's better. Uh, also, uh, it's called Who's There because there's a speech coming really soon. Here. I always missed it. Yeah, and that's uh, basically Friends on Mushroom EP. Um, which was supposed to be released in May, and of course he didn't believe it's your that. Fault. You didn't believe it's that, no. But nobody believed yeah, that. Of course. You know, May two fifteen. Yeah, so maybe. Maybe. Exactly. In May, 
I didn't say May, I said May B in May. Release date is gonna be 17th of June, or maybe one week before 10th of June, uh, but we're looking at 17th of June. Uh, I, I didn't say a year, did I say a year? I said 17th in June, could be next year, could be. 17th in June, by Dimac, uh, uh, worldwide, uh, we're gonna ha have a preview uh, soon on SoundCloud. I like this kind of preview on SoundCloud, but you can listen to the city. Why not? A lot of artists are doing it today. What do you say? They will download it. Let's just give it for download. Who cares? No, we won't. But anyway, no. But anyway, it's gonna be previewed and uh, before, uh, and uh, you're gonna have a link to get it before. So 17th of June, maybe. When is the leak date? Oh, I don't know the leak date yet. We're gonna it's announce gonna it, be so. in May. In May. B. Okay. Yeah. So Friends on Mushroom EP is ready. Uh, I gotta say, uh, pretty hardcore uh, artwork uh, by uh, Fiersas again, our fan that did uh, Friends on Mushroom Vol 2. Now, the good news about uh, this EP, uh, which ends this series, is gonna come a CD called Friends on Mushroom. What an idea, a CD. You know what a CD is? No, well, no. This is a round thing that you look at it and it does, you can, you can, you can put it on the wall and the dog runs after the light. You know this? You know? Yeah. Never mind. It's gonna be a Friends on Mushroom uh, CD, which will be all the EPs on one CD. So a physical CD, which we're pretty excited about, you know, to have a CD. And uh, yeah, uh, a lot of surprises coming with this release. And uh, yeah, that's a general uh, blog about uh, Friends on Mushroom Vol 3. And we're gonna go uh, into details about making these tracks uh, in a few more blogs that will come later on. This, this is more for the nerdy crowd. Yeah, like how we did the track. We're gonna go track by track, which bass line, what kicks, whatever. Which and we're gonna. So, which, yeah. yeah, we're gonna explain more about the making of the track. So, Friends on Mushroom Volume 3, June 17. We'll see what year. Dimac, Fact the Mushroom. Amazing. Amazing.